Hi everyone, thank you so much for watching. Today we're going to be talking about my October beauty favorites. Some new, some not so new products that I've been loving for this month. So if you're interested in seeing what my October favorites were, then please keep on watching. One of the first new items that I received this month was the new Huda Beauty Desert Dusk Palette. This is what it looks like. I think there's like two videos of me using this. I know one is coming soon that I haven't uploaded yet. But I've honestly been loving this palette. This is a very expensive palette, but they're beautiful shades. And I've been digging into this. It's being well loved. It's being well used. I used it for Halloween. I use it pretty much for my everyday makeup. I mean, I use it a lot. A lot. I like it. I like it. I enjoy it. Not super pigmented for what you would expect for an $85 palette. Not super pigmented, but they're really beautiful. They blend it super nice. The colors are super nice, especially this one, Twilight. I use that one a lot. The way I use it is actually by wetting the actual eyeshadow over just wetting my brush and then dipping it into the eyeshadow. So I actually put a little bit of whatever setting spray you have, wet it, make it into a paste, and I find that it actually amplifies the eyeshadow more. It makes it more pigmented, more creamy, and it shows up better in my opinion. So, so the next product is not new. I've used it a ton, a ton. I mean, every day when I do my makeup, or even when I don't do my makeup, I will use this primer because it is it's just a beautiful primer and I think it's honestly my favorite primer this is the Urban, Urban, Urban Decay Optical Illusion Complexion Primer this is smoothing, it has rose hip and argan oil and it's pore perfecting this is one of the few um, pore minimizing primers that actually does work in my opinion and I love it Like I'm, I got it this year and I'm pretty much eating through it because I wear this with makeup I mean like underneath makeup or if I'm not going to wear makeup so to the gym or anything I will use a primer and put it right in my problem areas would tend to be my nose, my cheeks here, my chin and it just helps you look smoother than what you actually are. So the next product that I wanted to talk to you about is also from the drugstore. This is the new L'Oreal Infallible Galaxy Stick Multi-Use Illuminating Stick. This is what it looks like. If you saw my previous tutorial, it was a Halloween makeup look and I was using this. This stuff is really good. If you like galactic highlights, you like this. Because this is basically what that is. It, this is what I have on my face right now. I love that blue lavender galactic highlight. I don't know what it is. It just calls to me. I'm like, oh my god, yes, give it to me. <laughs> but I seriously really, really love it. This is the product. It's a really big stick. Um, very blue. You won't be able to see it on camera. But it is a beautiful, beautiful stick. This is in the shade 13 Astro Blue. There are three shades. One's more of a pink, one is more of a purple, and one is more of a purple, dark purple blue thing. I don't have the other shades, so I can't tell you about those. But this one, I seriously love. I thought it'd be fun for October. And I recently got it, and I've been wearing it a lot, actually, when I do my makeup, of course. Or sometimes when I don't. I just pop a little bit on, and it just makes you look really cool. And it just gives you, I don't know, a really interesting look to your whole face. You know, situation going on. So I've been loving this. It's not really expensive. I would not swipe this on my face like, like that. I actually just, you know, warm it up with my finger and then you get that really pretty nice slick product on you. So it just is super nice. It's really pretty. You can definitely build this up, but I love it. It does last a long time. I do set it with the regular highlight just because I don't have a highlight this, a highlight powder this color, but I just set it with a regular highlighter and the color doesn't go away so just in case you wanted to know I've been loving that one last product that I've been loving loving and I mean loving because I wear it every single day every single day 
I wear this. The Anastasia Matte Lipstick in the shade Latte. A Latte. Latte. Amazing. 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 This stuff is really good. This is a super, super matte. And when I mean matte, I mean really matte to the point where it has like no glide, no creaminess to this lipstick. That just makes it super matte, but super long wearing because it doesn't have that creaminess, you know, slick to your lips. This is a little tough, but it is a beautiful, I mean, it's a beautiful shade. It is right up my alley and it's called Latte. I'm a coffee addict. I love coffee. So I thought, you know, she and I would pair very well together and we've become inseparable. We have become the best friends, the bestest of best friends. She does not leave my side. I know I can count on her because she always makes me look good even when I have no makeup on. And I'm, I'm going to wear one thing only. It would be her. She's always there for me. And I love her very much. We're good. She actually lasts a very long time on the lips, so honestly, it's a really long wearing lipstick. I can literally go to a fitness class or do my own workout, whatever. I will be sweating out of my mind, and that thing is still on my lips intact right after the gym. I think that says a lot. So there you have it guys, I hope that you enjoyed this video. This was my October favorites going on to November, which is next week. I'm filming this now because there's like two days left to November, so I will upload this prior to Halloween, I think, I hope, maybe. Hmm. Don't forget to give this a like, subscribe down below if you have not yet already, and I'll see you in my next video.